Hello everybody, welcome back to another installment of Beasts of Bermuda News. We actually have a lot this time, so uh, let's just get right into it. Also, for anybody who didn't get the memo, thanks for 100 subs. Uh, if, if you want some actual gratitude, just go to uh, the, the, the My Future of My Channel video. Um, it, it really means a lot. The video hasn't done as well as I want it to, so if, if you could just check that out, that'd be very nice. Thank you. First up, we have the Shimura Ricto. Now, I thought we'd start off small, and this is arguably one of the smaller smaller things we get. Um, and if you're wondering, the skin does actually grow. Gl glow. The skin does actually glow. More info about how to get the skin will be uh, located in the description. Normally there's an event, but uh, yeah. Next, we have some more Tropio animations. Uh, I have shown Tropio animations before, but recently, the, what I assume to be, final animations have been released to us. Now, uh, you, should, you should take a look. Mm -hmm. ah! Ah! He bit- Here we see the wild megalosaurus roaming the bare canyons. But seriously, these renders look amazing. Massive props to whoever made them. Megalosaurus one compared to the Ori one. And finally, a funny edit I made to it. Next, we have confirmation that the ankylosaur images I showed last time are just, in fact, a Cychania remodel. Uh, I don't actually have any proof of that, but it was, in this, it was in the most recent stream. You can go watch it yourself. I know you won't, so you're either going to have to take my word for it or just, <coughs> just deny it, but, uh... Yeah, you can do either one. I don't really care. Actually, never mind. You should watch the stream. You should support the devs. But then again, if you watch the stream, you don't have to come here. What? Okay, well, whatever. It doesn't matter. <coughs> Just watch the stream. Uh, we also have some statues, and I think these will appear like on the map in certain locations, especially considering the new map will entirely change what we think of Bermuda. And it'd be really cool to, uh, find these, like, covered in foliage, maybe in a high mountain or something. Maybe find one underground as an ori? I don't know. Good stuff. Uh, so I don't, I don't know how to transition into this, but, uh, why the heck does he look like this, Rex? Rex, are, are you good? Uh, s somebody should probably help him. No, I don't want to. Maybe he should. Uh, well, anyways, finally, we have a couple clips I found from the latest stream. Probably use its in-game in name. Um, I called it Counter in the Code, so sometimes I get mixed up. I named the ability after I'd finished the code for it, so in the code it's just called Counter. I was playing a lot of Super Smash Brothers at the time. Um, but, uh, there's 40 and a half, and then I use it one more time, it's 55. So, you know, previously, if I was to use this ability three times in a row, it would be 120 ability power. Right now, you'll notice the cost of this is about 125. Well, yeah, you can see that I can toggle my incognito on and off. Um, you know, the tags are the same thing. Uh, you see I've got the tags down here. Uh, you can make them whatever you want. I mean, you can see I literally just typed the word mod, admin, owner, donor, whatever you want to use it for. You can do it. Um, it's ju That's just how it works. Um, oh yeah, I forgot about the Venom. Okay, sorry about that. Um, I'll show you Venom. And now any player that can use it, it just takes your tag color away. And it takes away your tag itself. If you're an admin, it also takes away the golden chat color that you get to use. So, that is, you know, you can toggle it again using Cognito. Oh, oops, did I not? Oh, oopsies. Typo. Okay. Um, no, our crash system with this mechanic will never be as bad as what the Isles Dryo does, um, Radian. Uh, because there is, there's this totally dysfunctional, and ours actually works, so. Um. <laughs> nonetheless. Unfortunately, those clips don't really represent the entire stream, so I'll just sum it up. Basically, we got these cool new icons that appear when you get inflicted with the status effects, such as being roared by an acro or grabbed by a moza. 
There's also a couple new features involving graphics, like being able to hide skins so everybody looks default, or simply making skins appear like, unless they have knives that are stabbing your eyes repeatedly while you try to look away, you have knives in your eyes turning away would just make it worse. You have to ask them politely to take the eyes out. Take them out, Jeremy, take them out, take- Ori's can also no longer block themselves off in little tunnels to avoid getting uh, ate by Velo, as well as Velo being finally nerfed. Thank you, Beast of Bermuda devs. You finally listened. A Velo should not be able to take on an entire fucking herd of dinosaurs. It makes no sense. It makes no sense at all. And thank you for watching this video. It really means a lot to me when you guys watch my content. So I encourage you to stick around by liking, subbing, maybe clicking that little bell that goes ding. And also, you should probably check Discord. Haha, <laughs> just kidding.